codes. Now, what do you mean by low level code? You are having different levels of bomb. The header material is always zero level. Then second level components is called level one. And below that, if you are having still component that is called as a level two. So low level code is the lowest explosion level on which material occurs in all product structure. Okay. Means suppose now here, let me do something. This is my bomb. Okay. Let me edit this one slash and CL zero. What is happening, man? Ah. Hey. Suppose here I say I am using box hundred. Here also. Okay, so in my battery BLP also, I'm using one box. Okay. And here in my laptop B14, I'm also using this lap B box. Okay. So same box is used at, suppose you can see in this example, you can see here also we are having one slug and here also we are having one slug or something like that at level zero, one also and at level two also I'm having same component. Getting my point? It has happened very commonly. Suppose you take example of engine. Okay. In car engine, you are having some M10 bolt. M10 bolt is used for fastening your engine head at the cover also. And it is might be used for inside to uh, crankcase uh, assembly also. You can using same M10 bolt. Okay. So that is bit possible. Clear? Yes. yes. So one product can be used at level one, at level two, level three, at level five also. So low, low level code means what? When you create a bomb, a low level code is automatically assigned to each material, which is used in MRP and costing. Okay. Low level code are used in MRP to determine the sequence of the, in which material are to be planned. So when we are going to learn MRP, I will talk about this part, low level code, but just try to understand low level code is nothing but at what level this product is used according to the level is getting updated. Now here we are using box here in level two. See, this is my level zero. This is my level one, my bad. Okay. This is level one. And if I go in this sub, uh, sub assembly inside that again, I'm having it. Okay. So this box 10 is having two position. This is level two compared to my laptop B14 for laptop B14. It is at level one also. And inside this means level two also. So how I can found what is my level of the material. So you have to go to material master. Now I mean in MM03 and in metal master, if you click on this I button, the I button, then you can see you are having low level code updated for the material. That is low level code is 002. Why 002? What is the lowest level? Your material. So it's sub assembly also we have. Yeah. So why yeah. does in this sub assembly it is also used? My bad. Okay. Slash n CS03. In this sub assembly also it is used. Okay. And this battery is going. So there is one T code slash n CS15. Okay, this is one report. We'll go to that later. Okay, here if I put component box, what is that component box hundred, right? Box hyphen hundred. Yeah. Direct. Okay. So I can see where, what are the different bill of material in which it has been used. So it has been used for battery LP B15 and it is used for laptop B14. For these two different material, I have used it. Okay. But this battery, if I click on this battery, this battery B15 is also used for laptop B14. So that is a reason we are getting the low level code as a 002. Okay. If again, somebody use this box 10, 100, at something at a level below this slug something then it will have a 003 and below three also if you use it will become 004 what is the lowest level that will all be available for that particular material and which is used for bomb explosion in mrp that is a major use of it okay are we clear team everybody yes, okay 
Now, next part, I will take a small...